Yeah. Beautiful hoosters, come on in. Let's have lunch together. Y'all see what we got? That's that uh, Red Baron three cheese pizza. It's my lunch time, y'all, so we don't have the clapboard. Uh-oh, I'm about to knock my stuff over. Uh-uh. Y'all, look how pretty that is. Look at that. I'm ready, y'all. Okay, let's do this. Oh, let's say prayers. <laughs> Thank you, Father God, for this another beautiful, beautiful, beautiful day. Whew. Give us strength to go through these days, Lord. I want to pray for the nations, Father. I want to pray for the leaders in that White House, Lord. Give them what they need to do good by you. Oh, Lord, yes, 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 and yes. My God, thank you. Mm. Thank you. Let this food be nourishment to my beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray, amen and amen. Okay, y'all, here we are. Look here, it is hump day already. Hmm? This is hump day already, y'all. So, y'all ready? We're going to toast. But let's do uh, what they call it, the ASMR stuff they do. Because we're going to be drinking a pineapple soda pop. There we go. Okay, y'all. So the toasters have a good hump day. Hump through it. I don't care what you're going through. Be strong. Get through it. You'll be okay. So salute. Salute. Let's sip, sip this good pineapple pop. Cheers. Oh, that's so good. Y'all, I don't have a piece of cutter. Man, oh, y'all got to see the bottom of the pizza. Look at that. Can y'all see? Ooh, baby, we about to crunch on this thing, ain't we? Okay, it's 1230. I got 30 minutes left over. Y'all, so uh, I put more Parmesan cheese and I did some Italian seasonings and some more parsley on top before I put it in the oven. So we're going to have a lot of cheesy goodness, I hope. Oh, excuse me, y'all. Mm. I'm going to invest in me a pizza uh, thing like I eat that much pizza, y'all. I got these pieces because remember they was on they was on sale. I think for a dollar ninety nine, and now they they not that they not that cheap now. <laughs> okay, y'all, here take a bite. Yum, yum. Give me some, and it is piping hot, y'all. I didn't even get the um, ranch dressing, y'all. It's hot, y'all. I don't want that cheese to burn my mouth. Okay, y'all, we are over the Thanksgiving holiday. Today is December the first, honey. Uh, going into Christmas and the New Year's, y'all. Yeah. I hope y'all had a great Thanksgiving with your family. I did. And then I had some fun by myself, too. Mm-hmm. Ah, uh, hot. Mm. Ain't that hot. Mm. Ah, uh, hot. Oh, I'm sorry, hot. Woo! That cheese is hot. Mmm. Mmm. That cheese is hot. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. This tastes a little better than the, the meat uh, pieces that I had, y'all. Mm. I like that crunch. I 
I want to talk to y'all about something. Uh, um, I'm waiting for my renewal letter. It's December the 1st. If I'm going to move out, I have to do my notice 60 days. So December the 17th would be my cutoff to do that. So I called them. I told them I'm going to report them to the apartment association because y'all not giving me enough time. That's crazy to me. If I'm wrong, y'all comment below. But wasn't they supposed to give us 30 days before I was 60 days? Don't give me a week and a half. But I did find another bit and I did the paperwork too on Monday while I was out. So, it's hot. It's hot. Mmm. And it's still piping smoking. Mmm. Mm -mm -mm. So I'm waiting for the approval. The building is still being built. It's pretty too, y'all. Mm -hmm. So whatever God has already written, it will come too. Mm -hmm. Uh, hot. That's just too hot. This is not as hot as it is in the middle. That's why the cheese is. Well, I was talking to mother today, to mom today. I told her I don't want to see no more Thanksgiving food. Honey, the day after I was already putting my stuff in the freezer. And then I was thinking, y'all. I live alone, and I am a traditionalist when it comes to uh, Thanksgiving and Christmas and New Year's. I want to cook the dressing. I want to cook the food, you know. But you don't eat it all, you know. You put it in freezer bags. And for me, I put it in the freezer bag, forget it's there, or I don't want it, and then I have to throw it away, you know, after three months, you know. So I told Mother today, I'm going to worship my God, for real, on Christmas, but I ain't cooking. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Mm. I'm not cooking all that food. Because New Year's is what? Five days after? I told Mother I'm not cooking. She said she barbecuing. Mm-hmm. And the way she cook, that's my meal right there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's it. Oh, hot. Oh, hot. So, that's it. I don't know what my sister and I'm doing for this. They haven't thought about it. I know I got that party next week, y'all. And I found out we had to do uh, bring toys for children for, for the Salvation Army. I love doing that though. So I went to the store this weekend, this past weekend. And, uh, about uh, a boy toy and a girl toy. Because people are going through things this, this season. People have lost jobs. And then you have people that I that I, I interview every day who don't even want the job. So 
down. Y'all know Salvation Army has been around for many, many years. I do not mind helping them. Mm-hmm. I remember when my boys were small and they was in the Boy Scout and I was the leader, troop leader. Every winter we uh, donated winter clothes to the Salvation Army. Every winter. Mm -hmm. Blankets and stuff too. We sure did. Toiletries. You know, and when those boys did that, they, oh, that's hot. They, oh. Yeah, I thought this was going to be a little cooler. They enjoyed that. You know? I hope uh, my grandchildren learned that same thing to, to be a giver. You know? Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That's good and hot. So what are y'all plans for this, this uh, Christmas uh or is it too early for you guys to think about it? I'm going to be with my mom. Well, I'm also learning things from these young people. Because things have changed. People change. Things haven't changed. Everything God said is still the same. People change. And I know everybody got their own families. But for my generation... If your grandmother is alive or your mom is alive or whomever did the dinner, you everybody flocked to their houses, you know? I know today people don't do that, especially if the person who cooked is not alive anymore, like your grandmama. But as long as my mama is alive, she ain't going to eat nobody else's food, so... We can't bring no food to our house. We can bring the ingredients so she can cook it. But we can't bring anything cooked because she's not going to eat it. So with that said, as long as she can cook, I'm going to be at my mama's house. Period. Mm-hmm. All right. That's still hot right there in the middle. Man, that's hot. Mm. So, I'll be with mother again on Christmas. Because one thing I told my family, Everybody wants me. Y'all heard me say this before. Everybody wants me at their house. Come here. Come here. Do this. Do that. Come, 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 come. I don't want to spend my time on the highways and byways going to, to everybody's house. If we can't come to one house, then you're not going to see me. I'm not gonna be the everybody in the in the comfort of their home, but they want me to they want me to come here and go there. Uh, no, <laughs> no. Y'all understand? I'm getting older too. I don't want to spend my my holiday day on the road trying to get to everybody else's house. If we at mama house, everybody come to mama house. If we at sister house, everybody come to sister house. If we here, I don't have a lot of room like them, but I could fit a few people. And I want all that room. Mm. That's just the way I feel, y'all. But I'm not traveling all day trying to get to everybody's house. Period. You know what would have been good on here? My uh, jalapeno peppers. Mm-hmm. That's pretty, ain't it? 
Mm-hmm. I was thinking, y'all, packing sucks. But I learned my favorite maintenance man guy, his wife uh, cleans apartments. So I think I'm going to hire her. To come and clean, mm -mm, excuse me, I was spitting. To come and clean mine when I move out. I mean, all my cabinets and refrigerator, all that stuff is gonna be clean, but come and mop and stuff after I get out of the furniture out, you know? Mm hmm. Oh, y'all, I will be on the fourth floor. <laughs> I already got my apartment number. Mm hmm. I can dump this crunchy uh, piece in that ranch dressing, y'all, and be in heaven. Okay. I don't need all that. <laughs> so. I'm thinking about a dog again. I'm actively looking. So. Y'all may be meeting a dog in the next few months. Oh, yeah, I'm going to get me a piece of cutter, but I'm not doing too bad, ain't I? <laughs> okay, oh, well, we got to go. It's been 15 minutes. Take that last bite. Judy Caldwell, cooking with your girl Judy. She did a, um, I saw it again the other day. She did a uh, seafood pizza. I'm telling y'all I might do that. Oh, that's good. Yeah, it's really hot. Why is it still so hot? Oh. I guess it's that chicken, I mean that chicken, that cheese so thick in there. Oh, y'all, excuse me. Mm. Not bad. I would pick this cheese pizza over the other ones I had. With the meat on it? Mm-hmm. A salad would have been good too, y'all, of course. Pizza and a salad. Whew. My third piece, there it is. But we have to go. Thank y'all for eating lunch with your hood girl. Be safe, y'all. Yeah. Love each other as well, okay? And I love y'all. Let's see. It's time to say goodbye for now. We have another chance around on the other side. So whatever y'all do for the rest of this day, do it good, do it with purpose, and do it with what? Genuine love. Love you.